Hey, what's going on guys? Let's do this problem right here. The first question is asking the magnitude of the pointing vector of a plane electromagnetic wave has an average value of 724 milliwatts per meter square. What is the minimum value of magnetic field in the wave? So here they are asking for the magnetic field. Now let's see how we can find it. So since we are dealing with pointing vector, we can use this equation that pointing vector P is equivalent to 1 over mu times E cross B. So this is a generic equation but here they have mentioned that is average value of pointing vector right. So average value we have this equation P average is equivalent to 0 0.5 E dot B over mu right. Now here we are trying to find B but electric field is not provided right so we only have mu is permeability constant so we know that P average is here so 724 but electric field is not provided so we had to do something about that but there's an another equation for electric field that is E is equal to C times B right if I write this one I can get rid of this E now C is the speed of light so we already know that that is 3 times 10 to the power of 8 meter per second so here we can apply that one so if I plug this value that's going to give us P average is equal to 0 0.5 CB, CB so here we already have a B so this is going to be CB square over mu now since we are trying to find B we can rearrange this equation so this is going to be if I rearrange this this is going to be B square is going to be equivalent to P average times mu over 0 0.5 C right so this is B square therefore B is going to be equivalent to square root of P average mu over 0 0.5 C now P average is provided that is 724 and uh, mu is permeability constant and this is in milliwatts per meter square so hey, we have to multiply this one by 10 to the power of minus 3 and then mu is permeability constant that is 4 5 times 10 to the power of minus 7 and then we have 0 0.5 in the denominator so instead of writing 0 0.5 you can multiply by 2 also because if you write 1 over 2 in the bottom that's going to multiply the top so you can write 0 0.5 or multiply by 2 both of them give the same value now let's plug 0 0.5 and c is going to be 3 times 10 to the power of 8 right and if you plug all the values in calculator you should get 7.79 times 10 to the power of minus 8 Tesla so that's going to be the answer now let's look at this problem right here if the magnetic field of an average sorry if the magnetic field of an electromagnetic waves is in the plus x direction and the electric field waves in the plus y direction the wave is traveling in the which direction so here we are trying to, going to use again this formula so pointing vector that is equivalent to e cross b right so we only talk about the direction we are not calculating any value so we i'm for getting rid of this mu because we only look at the direction right now so here electric field is in the plus y directions right so plus y we call it j cross b magnetic field is in the plus x direction plus x mean i direction so if you cross cross uh, j with i what will it be so here we have i j k right and if you cross j cross i that's that will give you a negative k so here we are going to have, have a negative z direction so that's going to be the direction of this wave and that's how we do these kind of problems i hope you guys find this video helpful see you next time